How to add Mesh AP in your home. Make sure that you already have a ZTE Mesh Home Gateway working in your home and subscribe to a Mesh service from your operator. Otherwise, the Mesh AP will not work. Open the box of your new Mesh AP and plug one end of the power adapter into the power port of the AP and the other end into the power outlet. Then the LED indicator of the AP will flash red. Press the button WPS on the AP. The LED turns green flashing. Within one minute, press the button WPS on the ZT home gateway. The LED also turns green flashing. Then wait. The pairing process may take up to two minutes. When the pairing succeeds, the LED of the AP will turn blue. If the LED of the AP always flashes red, it means the pairing fails. In this situation, please check whether you strictly follow the above steps, otherwise you need to repeat them. If the LED of the AP is blue flashing, it indicates that the Wi-Fi signals are not good. You need to adjust the AP to a proper place until the LED of the AP is blue solid. Usually, you can put the AP between the home gateway and the blind point of your home. For a multi-floor house, it is strongly recommended to use wired networking for the APs on different floors. If you use wired connections for mesh networking, forget the WPS button. You just need to First, use an Ethernet cable to connect the WAN interface of the AP to the LAN interface of the home gateway. Second, wait for about 10 seconds. If the LED on the AP turns blue, the mesh networking is completed. If the LED of the AP turns red flashing, it means the pairing fails. In this situation, Please confirm whether the network cable functions properly and the network cable interface is connected well, otherwise you need to repeat the above steps. Here are some tips for mesh networking to get faster Wi-Fi speed and network quality. Tip 1. It is recommended to employ one home gateway and no more than three APs for networking. The mesh wireless networking supports no more than two hops. Tip 2. Do not place the AP too high or too low. Try to ensure that the home gateway and AP are close in height to the devices you use every day, such as mobile phones and tablets. Tip 3. Wired networking should be used between the AP and the home gateway on different floors. Now that you have a great mesh network, start surfing the web.